Hi everyone, welcome back. Well, I have a little bit of a shopping haul to share with you. Um, it's kind of been adding up, so I'm kind of like a hoarder at this point. <laughs> but, so I have a Rennie's bag, so it says, but there's only a few things, which are a couple small little containers, and everything else is from the Dollar Tree. So, we have been to a lot of Dollar Trees. So these are the cute little containers. They're kind of like little trays with a handle on each side. And I would have picked up quite a few of these little glass um, bottles with the little metal lids. Now, these look tiny, but what I'm wanting to put in these, the other little containers actually look um, really, really small compared to these. So I might take a picture and insert it in this video and you'll know what I mean. I'm going to grab it for a second, but I want to show you. I thought these trays were so cute from a store we have. It's a main store named Rennie's, family owned. I couldn't believe it when I turned this around to see that it was made in Poland. So I was just shocked. We thought at first, I kind of looked at it and I thought, well, they have those little things that protrude out on each side and it's so you can stack them. When my husband saw it, he thought they were, they were flawed, but they're really cute. So I ended up with small ones and then um, large ones. So at the Dollar Tree, I would have purchased two of these, one for a friend and myself, and then two of these, and they're just um, laser cut, I guess it's wood, it doesn't say, but I'm assuming it is, and then the little chalkboard tags, and these are just for a gift for a friend. So if you have these in your Dollar Tree, they're really good quality. I was surprised. It used to be that when I'd walk into a Dollar Tree, all I would buy was red licorice, black licorice from Australia, and soap. So, I mean, for them to have this line of crafting products, I'll actually pick things up now, which is amazing. These little stickers I thought were really cute. I don't know the quality. They look cute, but I have known in the past for stickers like this to curl. So, I don't know. I'm a little iffy. So again, when I've picked up two of things, one would be for a friend and then myself. I love music and play the piano and guitar. And then two of these, and I thought those were cute. So I'm surprised, and again, another one. They were only $2.99, and um, I don't even know what I could compare them to. They're not Dollar Tree quality, put it that way. They are something else. Pretty you almost think they were like wood. Perfect. And then I guess I could just hold this up. I went in with um, the larger bottles, with the little metal lids and I guess I'll, I was going to get them out but it's going to be a little difficult. I thought that I'd fill them with seed beads and I'll try to take a picture too and insert it in the video so you can see. And um, I have so many extra seed beads I thought that I'd give them also to my friend. Now these are the big trays. I couldn't believe it when I saw them because they're huge. And I have a bunch of toothbrushes, not that they're for myself, but I use them to splatter paint. So I ended up just pretty much picking up different styles that they had. I mean, when you're talking about a dollar and believe it or not, if you can find all different toothbrushes, they'll splatter paint all different ways. 
You'll have little fine splatters. If the little brushes are separated, they'll go in a different wider direction and the spots will be larger. So, and the little trays were only at Rennie's, I went back to Rennie's, but the little trays were $2.99. These large ones were only $3.99. Which are really, just the pattern is so cute. It looks like lace. I've never seen anything that looked like that. If other stores have them, um, I'd be surprised. So another one. And I just simply bought different colors of two. And again, two of each. I was wanting to do something for Easter with those. And, whoops, <laughs> Easter didn't even work out this year. So, needless to say, I never got crafting with them. And then I was really surprised that the Dollar Tree would have rolls of twine like this. <laughs> okay, um, I will cut that, but can you hand that back to me? <laughs> it would be funny to leave it in. <laughs> The stickers went for a ride, and... <laughs> I'm working on a little tiny table that I'm not used to working on, so things are just kind of going everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> okay, getting back to... <laughs> you know those um, news videos where the news person, especially the weather person, they get laughing so hard and they can't talk? And you are just, because it's live, you're sitting there just dying for them to get their composure and they can't. Mm. Oh, I've watched the I best videos ever. So it's really funny. Maybe I should just hold up two instead of four. <laughs> <laughs> well, let me see. I haven't filmed a video in months. I have not been on YouTube in, what, over three months, I think? So, hey, this is what you're getting. <laughs> <laughs> So, back to the twine before everything went flying. I couldn't believe this, that it was such a large amount. I almost bought another little package of four that I saw. Um, now, that was what should have been at the Dollar Tree, not this. They should have had four dollars on this. So, I ended up getting two of each. Again, I'm buying for a certain lady. And then I bought... Um, one, well, two each of these, the little mesh, which would have been cute for Easter as well. So I actually found things at the Dollar Tree. I'm amazed. And this little foam mounting tape, this is really good by Super Glue. When you can buy like name brands at the Dollar Tree, I think that's pretty good. You couldn't find this for a dollar in Hobby Lobby or any crafting store. So I've got eight alone right in here and thought I would share. Another tray, I'm not quite sure. I think I bought a half dozen. So again, would I have eight, 11? And I ended up picking up um, six of these little cork sheets that have adhesive on the back. I just thought of a different little ID and I thought it would be awful cute to use on a greeting card. And I'll share those. Now these, this one did come from the Dollar Tree, a charger that I thought was really pretty. And I had just been in Hobby Lobby and had purchased this one. Where am I getting this mixed up? Maybe I purchased, I can't even remember now. Well, let's see the back. I don't know. Wasn't it Dollar Tree? I think this was Hobby Lobby and this was the Dollar Tree. Okay. I'm getting mixed yep. up. Whatever. There. I, I remember the goal was at the Dollar Tree. Oh, okay. Well, then this is the Dollar Tree and this is Hobby Lobby. This one actually looks better than Hobby Lobby. So they probably say manufacturer, maybe. I couldn't believe it. 
And the last one. So this is keeping it real. I don't even think I'm going to edit. I think I'm going to just... We have the best time filming. This is what I need to have a happy video to get back to videos. Um, this is very pretty. This type of ribbon. I guess you'd call it or well, gem mesh, which you'd use like a ribbon. So the gold and the green. And I have two orange and red. Is that camera getting that good? Mm -hmm. And then um, red, like two rows of red. Now, I think I did have a couple different colors, or am I mistaken? Did I have something hid? Remember you picking up... Um, Didn't you and Daddy get two colors? Yeah, it was like it was a red and red, and uh, we must have set them someplace. I don't know. Well, they must be somewhere else. That's strange. But my husband got in the Dollar Tree and said there's red and red, and then I was wanting. You were wanting blue and purple. Yeah, I was wanting. Um, Okay, this is it. I'm looking at it. I was getting a little bit mixed up because I was seeing two. They're so similar. This was blue and purple. So I was asking my husband if he would find blue and purple. He said, well, there's blue and blue. And I, we were on the cell phone talking to each other. I said, blue and blue. I said, um, is your item number, and I went on to read it off, ending in 2-9. He said, yes. I said, I literally went as far as to say, well, you're, you must be colorblind. And it was really funny. And then he's saying, red and red. And I'm asking him, well, does it end in 2-7? Yes. Well, I've got the same one, and mine is orange and red. So I'm accusing him of being colorblind. <laughs> when he got home, no lie, it was, um, what was it, orange and orange? Or like a red and red? And blue and blue. And he was right, just their colors were different. So, but I can see it's very hard to see these colors. So poor thing, anyway. Crazy story. And then I've got a bunch of a Lane's glue which I was thrilled because this size is really nice to work with. That wasn't the Dollar Tree. Yeah. Seriously. Yep. So two, four, six, eight, nine. I ended up with nine. So this is just a perfect little size. Oh, actually, just to get the little tiny glue bottles. I don't like filling my own bottles with glue, but I'll spend quite a bit just to get the little tiny ones where... This is, I think, Walmart for a dollar ninety-nine, if I'm correct. So a dollar, yeah, that's really good, really good, unless I'm mistaken. But these little tiny bottles, I love these, and they're really tiny, but they're expensive. Mm. Anything tiny seems to be very expensive. Um, a dollar, these are just perfect to work with. So. I'd buy your glue at the Dollar Tree. And I think that wraps it up. So this is the craziest. Oh, and believe it or not, when it came to this size, I thought I was seeing things. So I had just, we were in a hurry and I was just trying to pull them off of the hook in the Dollar Tree and didn't realize one of the lids, it's not even in the package. <laughs> So my husband's already replaced it. So you do have to look, but still glass. I would think that this should be valued at four dollars, not a dollar. So I'm kind of amazed at that. All right. Well, those are my little finds from the Dollar Tree. So I was just thrilled that I could actually find crafting products where before, like I said, it was licorice and soap. 
occasionally I'd pick up some florals, but this was a good little haul. And this would have been from, wow, Bangor, Brewer, um, Lincoln, Holton. I went to a few different, even Orono, I believe. So five different Dollar Trees to get this. Oh, all right. Well, I have more shopping hauls, so I will be back. And I thank you for watching. Bye-bye.